1.0 was our first attempt at creating a program that could help growers crop steer. We did base it solely off of live sensor data. Because it's a sensor trigger base, we had fuel capacity. Fuel capacity is not stationary, it changes sometimes every day. You know, if my fuel capacity target was 55%, it's not going to move me into maintenance phase until I hit 55% like sensor reading. And if the sensor couldn't actually read 55%, it's going to continue to try to ramp up until light, you know, until the batch tank is empty. So you were always overshooting. It just seemed to happen very consistently when growing in cocoa. The only workaround around that was to just get off the program and go to a timer-based solution, which was what we were doing for a lot of people. And then the last thing was no EC targeting. So a big part of crop steering is substrate EC. Um, you had to do that manually. But, but they would have to know how yeah. to do that because the system's not directing you. So what Copilot does is it takes your real data here, and then it compares it with what you want to happen through your targets page. Um, and then it's figures out a way, like changes that you can make to both targets and schedule to bring those two together. It knows what you want to do, and it's going to look at what you did, and it's going to say, okay, you didn't hit your field capacity. And it's going to give you recommendations. It's going to tell you, it's, it has, that's where the advanced like calculations come in. It's like, okay, we've analyzed the trends. These are the suggestions. It breaks them up into the phases, so like P1, P2. Th this is what we have, and this is what we want. And you can see they're close, but they're not, it's not that. So how do we get it to this? How do we, how do we make this here um, turn into this? And so what it's telling us to do in order to do that is to change our fuel capacity target from 45 to 60% because Copilot has detected that 60% is closer to your actual fuel capacity. These are the tweaks that it needs to make to bring those two together. It'll give you recommendations of changing any of those. Yeah, so... So it, 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 irrigation events, times... Everything. Everything. And the way this works is it analyzes it at every 24 hours and tweaks it and fine-tunes it. So it might not be perfect day one, but over a period of like three to five days, you're going to be spot on, especially when it comes to EC. I think what I like about Copilot is it's not just making the changes for you. It's telling you why you should make those changes. So it's a tutorial as you're growing real time. This is meant to have that assistant there to be like, hey, I got you. Like, you're programming me. You're, t you're telling the Copilot what you want it to do, and then it's going to do it for you and help you out.